I guess it would move if it wasn't there. No, his leg is broken. I saw when he was standing up, but now Where? you can't see. I don't You can see it when he's the Oh, see. that's really sad. Help it. What do we do? Oh. We pet you. No. Just sit down. Oh. Sit down. I hate those Israeli soldiers. Can you tell us what happened today? Early in the morning, about 6 o'clock in the morning, Israeli bulldozer with a lot of soldiers, more than 200 soldiers, came to this place. They make a kind of curfew against people here, and they start destroying the sheikh and some sheikh and houses for the people. Actually, all the people around here, they, they have demolished order from the Israeli uh, occupation authority. We try to help this community to do something through Israeli court. We are not sure if this court is a kind of just a thing or not. I mean, what we see is that it's part of the incubation system. Because in the other side of the street, we have the, the settlement who have the right to have electricity, drinking water, swimming pool, green areas, whatever, protection. And the left side of the street is the Palestinian community who live here before establishing Israel, who lived here a long, long time ago, and this land is registered in the Jordanian document as a refugee camp. But as you see, they took a decision to destroy this part of this community, and all the community around, they have demolished all them. I hope that we will be able to do something to help people to stay in their homeland. How do you think we can help people? I think existence is resistance. So Israel is established in a big line called people without land for a land without people. It's our land. We are here before them and we will be here after them. So we want to encourage the people to renovate their knock down houses to help them to build new ones. I think we need to refuse this policy. We need to resist against this policy because it's it's a racism, it's a apartheid regime. It's, I don't know what's happened here. It's a kind of ethnic cleansing. Can you describe what was happening this morning? I heard uh, there were settlers here watching and that they were cheering. As yeah, the settlers, they are the real, you know, reason for what's happening here because they are all time they are creating problems. They are trying to build fence around this community, they are trying to take more and more land and at the same time they are pushing the Israeli occupation military administration in the area to come and to, to bulldoze the Palestinian house. Mm -hmm. And when they when they came here they, when they destroyed the house of the settler, you know, they were dancing, you know, and shouting and you know singing and when even when they beat people and when they arrested people, you know. They are just there and they are like, you know, encouraging the soldier to do more and more violence against the people. And how many people were arrested and how many were hurt? They arrested three people. They released one and still two people in the Israeli prison. Okay, and someone was hurt on the ear or something? Someone was beat? Yeah, the old man. Mm -hmm. Even he, like, have a heart surgery less than one year ago. Mm -hmm. But always they did not respect him.